Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to make some old-fashioned roller skates that I designed in Fusion 360. Um, and these are the old-fashioned ones that I used myself as a kit. The ones that you are uh, kind of strapping around your um, shoes that you have on in the first place. Um, but let's get to it. So here I have all the 3D printed parts for a pair of roller skates. And first of all I am taking this heel part here and I am gluing that to the back of the roller skates. Um, that's the end where there is no wheel. So I'm just doing that on both of these. Then I am using my black Vallejo paint to paint the skates themselves, uh, the body of them. And I'm doing this because I like the uh, black showing through when I am using my silver later, uh, which is going to make them look old uh, without making some kind of aging on these skates. Then I am going to paint all the wheels with my red Vallejo um, and I'm doing it all the way around. I'm just taking one side at the time and let them dry to take them off the little uh, double sided tape that I have here on the stick and then paint the other side. I'm also going to paint the wheel on front of the uh, roller skate themselves. I am using this true metal paint here. You can use whatever kind of silver paint you like, but I think this one is fitting really nice for these skates. So I'm just giving them uh, a nice layer of this silver paint. And yes, my fingers are all silvery when I'm done with this, uh, but the result is really good. And because we have the black underneath, it doesn't matter if there is a spot or two we don't hit with the silver. It will still look really neat. Just be careful that you don't put it onto the red wheels in the front. Now for the wheels, I am using a piano string here, cutting off a piece that is a little less than a centimeter and I'm gluing a wheel on one end putting it through the roller skate and then gluing a wheel on the other end. Um, you can glue the wheels directly onto the roller skates because in the long run no one will ever notice if the wheel can turn or not. But well, I'm just doing it because I can. Oh, and the download link for this 3D file is in the info box below, so you can find it right there. Um, I could have made these in polymer clay, but I thought it was funnier to do it in 3D print. Because um, I can get a lot more nice details with in my 3D print. I'm using a thin piece of leather and cutting out some thin strips here for the um, strips around your feet on these um, roller skate. I cut two pieces of two centimeters for each of my skates. 
One of the strips I am first gluing on one side of this heel cap and I'm doing that on both of the um, skates here. When that has dried I am using my tacky glue again on the other end of the strip and then I am bending this strip and placing it on the other side of the heel cap and again I'm doing this on both of these. The next two strips I am gluing here in the front beneath the front wheel of the roller skates. So I'm just placing the strip and squeezing it really good into the corner and I'm doing this on both of these. I let that dry before I glue the other side here. I am again putting some tacky glue on the strip, turning that around the skate, skate, turning it around the skate and placing that underneath again, underneath the wheel here and making sure that it is gripping. And again, do this on both of your uh, roller skates. If you want them to look a little rusty, you can use this rust texture from uh, the green stuff. And I'm just using a middle spatula and just placing a little here and there. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching and happy crafting. Subscribe.